Hello, I'm Elif and this is a recap for episode 23 of the series My Name is Farah, 24 hours after Turkey and before dubbed for TV. Tahir brings Farah and Karim Shah to his home and declares that the first rule of the house is to banish sorrow and grief, always maintaining a cheerful atmosphere. Then, he captures their first memorable moment together by taking a photo. At Benham's house, he refuses to eat due to distress, and Rapshan scolds him, insisting that he should abandon Farah but reclaim Karim Shah. Benham asserts that he will return his son at any cost. Farah and Tahir put their plan into action to find Farah's mother. They ask Karim Shah to pretend to be ill, and they take him to the hospital. Benham's associates, who are keeping an eye on them, immediately inform Benham of the situation. Upon witnessing Mehmet's good behavior towards Baki, Parihan, tauntingly, questions Mehmet about forgetting his brotherhood. She asks Baki to leave her daughter alone. Mehmet, surprised, says to Baki, you're with my sister. How dare you? Bardo remarks, if you can be with his sister, why can't he be with yours? Mehmet states, they have nothing to do with each other, and he adds to Gunal. Couldn't you free yourself from these troublesome relationships? Bardo angrily leaves the scene. At the hospital, Dr. Karim Shah examines Karim Shah and states that a definitive opinion can be given after the test results. Benham arrives to see Karim Shah and asks Farah to leave him alone with his son. Suspicious of Farah, he tries to provoke Karim Shah's feelings to extract a confession, but Karim Shah remains silent. Baki, playing the role of an inspector, enters the hospital and distracts the attention of the laboratory officials. Farah alters Karim Shah's information so that the doctor provides a re-diagnosis. Mehmet goes to see Elias and tearfully confides in him. He reveals that his brother is in Benham's hands, and Benham has set a condition to kill Tahir. He has decided to carry out this task and seeks Elias' assistance. He asks Elias to take Tahir to a remote location. Mehmet says, if I killed Tahir on the day of the operation, I would be a cop doing my duty, but now I'm becoming a killer. Mehmet leaves, and Elias, thinking that Mehmet remembers Tahir from the day of the operation, smiles. The doctor informs Benham and Farah that they need to perform another bone marrow transplant on Karim Shah. Farah, with concern, says, thank God his father was the donor, and he's here now. Benham suggests the surgery should be done in Iran. But the doctor insists they can perform the transplant right there. Farah adds, if you're worried about the medical team, bring them from Iran. Benham feels defeated. At night, Elias visits Benham and tells him that Mehmet remembers everything and wants to play the game. He then calls Tahir, who is with Mehmet, and arranges a meeting, also informing Mehmet that everything is set for tomorrow to kill Tahir. Elias thinks to himself, tomorrow, I'll destroy both of you. Gunal, with sadness, tells Baki that she understands the concerns of Mehmet and his mother, and they have the right. She asks Baki if he has truly abandoned the dispute. Baki responds, do you know when I left the dispute? When I looked at you with love. After you, I won't be contaminated even if I want to. They kiss, and someone takes a photo of them. In the middle of the night, Karim Shah, influenced by his father's words, wakes up from a nightmare and expresses his displeasure with deceiving his father. He angrily tells Farah, you tell me not to lie, but you want me to lie for you. Didn't you say he saved my life? Farah can't provide an explanation and only asks Karim Shah to trust her, but he remains unconvinced. Before Tahir arrives, Mehmet hides at the meeting point. As soon as Tahir enters, Elias disarms him. Mehmet enters with his gun pointed at Tahir, saying, someone dies today, but it won't be my brother. Tahir pleads with him not to do this, and after hesitating, Mehmet says, I can't. Elias takes the gun from him to finish the job himself, declaring, with the weapon I took from Tahir. I'll kill you. Elias reveals that he knows everything and has realized that Mehmet remembers everything. Thinking that Mehmet and Tahir were playing a game, Elias immediately shoots them when he realizes they are aware of being brothers. However, the guns don't fire. Tahir and Mehmet hand Elias over to the police, who are waiting for them. However, Elias orders his police accomplice to let him escape. They attempt to flee, but Tahir blocks their way and captures them. Tahir tells Mehmet, this side adventure was a good feeling for me. Mehmet responds, the police would have been good for you. The chief police officer hands Mehmet's badge back to him and he rejoins the police force. Karim Shah is continuously crying and is angry with his mother for deceiving Benham. Farah is forced to tell him the truth, that Benham deceived them and has been imprisoned for years as the mother's organ donor. Karim Shah can't believe it. Benham and Mehmet are in the police station, 
and the police chief asks Mehmet to arrest Tahir because he exposed Akbar's collaboration with the government. Mehmet obeys, and Tahir looks at him angrily. Tahir says he must save Farah's mother, and after arresting him, Mehmet calls Bada, telling her to release Tahir. Bada manages to arrange Tahir's release until the trial. Marjan, who has been monitoring Farah at Benham's orders, finally realizes that Farah has outsmarted her. However, when she tries to inform Benham, Farah grabs her wrist. They struggle in one of the hospital rooms, and Farah puts Marjan to sleep. Farah's mother enters the hospital wearing the Iranian medical team uniform. She watches Karim Shah for a while from behind the glass, and upon seeing the wound mark on her palm, Karim Shah mutters to himself, My dad lied. Farah and Tahir enter the operating room. But instead of Farah's mother, Benham is there. The people accompanying Benham take him out after the operation is done, and Karim Shah realizes this. He informs Adele, who, while beating the man, takes his grandmother, Karishma, to her room and reassures her, saying, Don't worry. No one can find you here. My mother will be very happy to see you. When Karim Shah hears his father's voice, he kisses his grandmother and says, Dad shouldn't see you. If he comes here, he'll hurt you. But he can't do anything to me. Farah's mother asks him not to go, but Karim Shah goes to Benham. Seeing Karim Shah, Benham says to him, You lied to me. Karim Shah replies, Because you are a very bad person, and runs away. When Farah enters Karim Shah's room, she is face to face with her mother and tearfully embraces her. The woman, crying, says, Karim Shah is gone. I couldn't stop him. Farah and Tahir are shocked. Thanks for watching, stay tuned for the next episode.